Hey traders, this is Steve Miley, market chartist again here for FX Explained and here we're taking a look at the FTSE 100 future, the future on the top 100 stocks in the UK, the index for the top 100 stocks, the FTSE 100. Well, uh, an erratic tone in here over the last couple of weeks and certainly even over the last two to three weeks in here since this top was put in in the um, early to mid part of June at 65, 12 and a half. The market's been in a kind of an erratic, you would say an erratic downtrend. We did get kind of a little pop higher at the beginning of the this week and then kind of a setback and, and rebounding here kind of cautious tone um, going into yesterday um, capped off by this resistance is here in the 62 23 24 area and we see kind of a broader intermediate term range defined by 65 12 and a half and 59 30 and a half but certainly with this downtrend line trying to stay intact in here and given the f um, repeated failings from below this 6302 and a half, 63.10 area, and we do see the risk more skewed to the downside for this to be a potential big in top, a bigger topping structure. And we're seeing similar kind of patterns here across the European and US equity averages. And we'd still think um, downside threat in the short term for this week back down to this 59.86 and a half level, but 59.30 and a half to swing low from mid June is going to be critical, and a breakdown through there would signal a more bearish shift. If we get back above the peak in here from earlier in June at 65, 12 and a half, that would then signal an intermediate term more bullish thing. So caught in here between these broader parameters, short term risk lower and for us also the intermediate term threat for a more bearish signal as we go into the early part of July. This has been Steve Miley, the market chartist for FX Explained. I wish you all a great trading day and do be safe out there.